I'm not asking you to talk about the next product announcement, but <laughs> tease us about what else is in your pipeline, what next problem you are working on solving for the ecosystem. Yeah, yeah, there's a feature we shipped, uh, you know, just two weeks ago. It's called Vcluster or Snapshot. And Vcluster Snapshot is a way to take a snapshot of an entire Kubernetes cluster, a virtual one, of course, right? And it takes seconds to do that. When you, you know, historically, if you did Kubernetes backups with things like Valero, right, it takes very long, right? Because it has to iterate over all the resources, run a lot of kubectl requests to get all the data out of that Kubernetes cluster. When you restore it, you know, you have issues with owner references and IDs are different, right? Um, so, yeah, a whole bunch of, uh, like, Taking, you know, backups in Kubernetes clusters are really complex. We launched, um, you know, Vcluster Snapshot and Restore, which is a way to create an, an OCI artifact, like an image. Instead of an image of a container, it's an image of an entire cluster, right? And you can take it in seconds, you can store it in an OCI registry, you can put it in an S3 bucket, and you can restore a cluster from there. Uh, that's entirely open source, and we're working on the commercial counterpart which is automated backups. It will be part of the vCluster platform. So instead of running a CLI command to take an individual snapshot, you can actually tell the platform, hey, my entire fleet of virtual clusters, back it up every night, right? And you can kind of streamline these kinds of operations. Really day two operations for virtual clusters at scale. That's what we're focused on. Monitoring and alerting is another big theme that we're working on in Q2, uh, besides you know backup and restore for, for your virtual clusters. So.